Okay, this is Manjunath Chandraya. Today you'll be learning how to create a hyperlink dashboard using the existing data. So I have a sales report here, I have a production report, sales chart and the production chart. Let's create a, a hyperlink dashboard. So for that we can create a sheet. Just to create a sheet. So we'll name it as summary summary sheet summary and so we have a uh, grid lines here so you can remove the grid lines going to view remove grid lines so it became a plain sheet so uh, to uh, first we'll add some shapes we'll go to the insert shapes so let me add for a report for sales report so i'm just clicking on it so here you can select the any other color so let me select green so let me go right click on it go to edit it is sales report sales report you can select this one you control dark if you want to do it dark control b so once you click sales report so once the sales report is done let me create for a the other report so just click on it drag this whole control and drag it to a little further. so let me try again hold control drag it so it creates a copy of it so here we'll create it as production report production report right click on it just drag this whichever whatever shape you wanted and you can change the color go to formats the format let me select uh, production for uh, purple same thing we need a graphs chart so i'll just drag it this down create a chart charts same thing just control full control drag just drag it so you'll get a copy of it so production chart charts are chart okay if you want you can change the color to let me change this to light blue and this is we can change this color to let's say yeah this one too you can align yourself this data okay so let's say we'll name this as a company so go insert again so let's say i'll just drag it and add the text abc manufactures manufactures you can select this do control p to dark you can change the format to any other let me change to blue yes so you can align this one okay so just click on it just so now we have created a tab so once you create we need to link these two uh, respective sheets so for that go to sales report right, right click on it you can see hyperlink here click on hyperlink once click on hyperlink there are a lot of options here you should go to place in document place in document is nothing but the, the file which we are working on it has multiple sheets here summary sheet sales report production sales chart and the production chart so this is for a sales report so i can go and select the sales report sheet here it says a1 so the cursor when you click on it automatically goes and stays stays in the a1 cell let's say it let it be there so i selected the sales report so click ok now you see if you click on it automatically takes me to the a1 sales report so so we are we, so I, I need to come back from here to there so for that we'll do it later so what we can do next to you same thing production hyperlink so production tab report a1 same thing for sales report right click hyperlink sales chart and this is for the hyperlink right click and the production chart so let me click on sales report automate takes me here from here i don't want to come click on it on the summary sheet so automatically i have a button here so when you click it automate takes me to the to the summary sheet so for that again you can insert the sales report just you can use the arrow key let me use the the return arrow key so you can right click on it edit text just you can say back So which you can align yourself this 
so again i can do the formatting so i can change it to any other structure see uh, any other so let's say blue okay let me take it so i can drag it a little bit yeah so just click on it um just right click again hyperlink now we need to go back to summary sheet so just select summary sheet and a1 so when you click on it automatically takes you to the summary sheet so this right click on it copy go to each sheet you can paste it sales report i can click it here production report i can click it here so when i click here automatically takes to the summary sheets so now i selected all these things if you click sales it takes me to the sales report so click back sales chart i can see the report click on the back it will come back to the summary sheet same thing production sheet click back it will take you to the summary production chart back to summary sheet so again you can add anything here any more you know, multiple charts or you can i can make some some more uh, uh, like add your logos you can uh, uh, define your uh, dashboard neatly so i hope uh, this was uh, helpful and uh, let me know in the comments if you need anything else to so that i can try to sh uh, share those things in going, uh, upcoming videos thank you